Good evening, teacher. Hello. Good evening. Hola. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Hello.
23, okay. Okay, people, good evening one more time. How are you today? Good evening. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Hello. Hello. How was your weekend? Did you have a nice weekend? Relax, working. Yes, relax weekend. Okay, good for you. Hey, Jonathan. Welcome back. Come and go. Come and go. Welcome back. Okay, people, let's get it started tonight. I'm gonna take the first attendance. Okay. Okay, first, just let me share the... Let me share, share with you tonight's quote. So you can read and practice and repeat. Let me open my WhatsApp also. Here in my phone. Okay. Tonight's, tonight's quote says, no matter how you feel, get up, dress up, show up, and never give up. Can you read that? It's in WhatsApp. Let me share it here. Let me share the screen. Okay. Let's see. No matter how you feel, get up, dress up, show up and never give up. Can you repeat after me, please? No matter how you feel. No matter how you, how you feel. feel. Get up. Get up. Get up. Dress up. Dress up. Dress up. Dress up. Show up. Show, show up. up. And never give up. And and never never give, up. Give, up. give up. Okay. One more time. No matter how you feel, no matter how, how you feel, feel, get up, get up, up, dress up, dress up, dress up, show up, show up, show up, up and never give up. And never, never, never give, up. give up. Okay, now I'm going to read the whole quote. Todo y luego lo repita. No matter how you feel, get up, dress up, show up, and never give up. No matter how no you matter feel, how no matter get up, dress up, get up get show, show up, up, and, and never, never, give give up. Up. never give up. Very good. 
Okay, when I call your name, I want you to read that. You can read it in your WhatsApp. Okay, for the attendance, I want you to read that. Okay, look in WhatsApp. Because I need to see everyone here in camera. Okay, let's start with Anna Lilian Reyes. Present teacher. Okay. Can you repeat the tonight's quote? No matter how you feel, there is no so and never here okay good thank you uh, brian javier carmona brian javier carmona present teacher okay can you read tonight's quote How matter how you feel, get up, dress up, show up, and never get up. Okay, good. Don't turn off your camera, Brian. Okay, Dinora Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Okay, can you hear? Can no, you read matter, no matter how you feel, get up, dress up, show up, and never give up. Excellent. Frida Janine is having difficulties tonight. Javier Aldair Escobar. Present teacher. Okay, read it please. Okay, no matter how you feel, get up, dress up, shop up, and never get up. Yes, good. Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. Not yet. Jose Galileo Barrera. No matter how you feel, get up, dress up, show up, and never get up. Get Excellent. Up. Very good. Jose Jonathan Vigil. Present. Okay. Read it, please. No matter how you feel, get up, dress up, show up, and never give up. Good. Very good. Jose Rodrigo Hernandez. Present teacher. Thank you. Read it, please. No matter how you feel, grow up, dress up, show up, and never get up. Okay, good. Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Present teacher. Thank no you. Matter, no matter how you feel, get up, dress up, show up, and never get up. Good, very good. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present teacher. Thank you. Read it. Uh, uh, no matter who you feel, get up, dress up, show up, and never give up. Okay, good. Maria Concepcion Ceron. Present teacher. Okay, read it. No matter you, how, do, how you feel, get up, dress, dress up, show up, and never give up. Yes, excellent. Maria Ivania Palma. Present teacher. Good. Read it, please. No matter, you, no matter how you feel, get up, dress, dress up, show up, and never give up. Excellent. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. No. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. No. Mayra Veralice Moreno. No. What's going on with Santa Ana? Rocío Lourdes Pimentel. No. Zaira Marlene Larín. Present teacher. Thank you. Read it, please. No matter who you feel, get up. Dress up, show up, and never get up. Okay, good. And Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present teacher. 
No okay. matter how you feel, get up, dress up, show up, and never give up. Excellent. Very good. Thank you. So, what is the meaning of no matter how you feel? Who knows? No matter how you feel. No importa cómo te sientas. Yes. No importa cómo te sientas. Yeah. Sometimes I feel sad. I feel depressed. I feel tired. Uh, I feel discouraged. Desanimado. No, 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 no. Don't pay attention to your feelings. You know, you, you must not be led for your feelings. Tú no te debes de guiar por tus sentimientos. No, no, no I, I believe that. So, los sentimientos son engañosos. Sí. Hay días está alegre, más y si es bipolar, hoy a, hoy a todos le dicen bipolar. Hoy a todos le dicen bipolar. <ríe> sí, es bipolar, es que ella es bipolar. No, bueno. Como dicen, ¿verdad? También antes eh, 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 nadie sabía que el gluten era, le hacía daño, nadie le hacía daño. Hoy ya sabemos que el gluten hace daño, a todos les hace daño. Bueno, a saber, man. Entonces, los sentimientos, no matter how you feel, no, my feelings are not uh, the ones that determine my decisions. That's, that's why, por eso dicen que no tome decisiones when you are so happy, no, don't make a decision, or when you are so sad, don't make a decision in that moment, okay? You must be calm. Okay, no matter how you feel, you have to you get up. So get up. No, don't stay in bed. Dress up. What is dress up? Vistete. Show up. Show up. Okay, you go. Muéstrate, teacher. Muéstrate, preséntate, ¿verdad? O sea, da la cara. Aparece. Aparece, ¿verdad? Eso es cuando, cuando dicen, nunca vino, no, no llegó. Tú dices, show up. He never showed up. Nunca llegó. ¿Verdad? Eh, es llegar, hacerse presente, ¿verdad? And never give up. What is give up? Y nunca te rindas. Nunca te rindas. Rendirse, por ¿verdad? Darse por vencido, rendirse. No, como en la lucha ya le tocan, ¿verdad? Ya, 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 ya. Give up. Eso es give up. Rendirse, darse por vencido. Ok. So, no matter how you feel, get up, dress up, show up, and never give up. Ok. Remember that. Ok. Good. Now, well, tonight we are going to start talking about something different, but uh, just a, a quick review on these sentences that we, that I gave you last Friday. Uh, let me share the screen with this. Okay. Last Friday, we talked about what clauses. Yeah, what clauses. So what clauses are just some phrases, some yeah, phrases that start with what that can be the subject of another sentence. What I'm in this case. Veamos. No sé si lo hicieron. Espero que sí. Tuvieron el fin de semana. 
Y vamos, quiero escuchar algunas de sus, de sus oraciones. ¿Cómo completaron esto? ¿Verdad? Dice, todo debe de comenzar con un what. Uh, what I'm going to do. What she should do. What. Uh, diferentes formas de poderlo terminar. Por ejemplo, les decía, my boss is always yelling at me. What I'm going to do is quit the job. Yeah. No more yelling. No more yelling. Okay. What about number two? A ver, ¿quién me dice que le, cómo la completó? She's eating too much junk food. ¿Alguna ya idea? Yo la tengo, um, teacher. Dime. What you need is to save money. En, en, en number perdón, two. Perdón, perdón, perdón. No. La, la dos. What she uh -huh. should, should do is not, do is eight healthy. Okay, healthy. Very good. She is eating too much junk food. What she should do is eat healthy. Very good. Okay, now number two. Number three. You are spending too much money. A ver, alguien más? ¿Qué puso? ¿O qué se le ocurre ahorita? You are spending too much money. Uh, teacher. Uh -huh. eh, con Frida se escribió, I am going, what I am going to do is to save some money. Going to do is um, to save some money. Money. Okay. Okay. Number four, the company is not growing. A ver, a ver, alguien más. Voluntariamente, antes de hacerlo dedocráticamente, dígame. What, what we need, what we going to do? What we are going to do is create good marketing. Good marketing. Okay, good. Next, my car is not comfortable enough. Mm -hmm. Ideas? What I'm going to do is save money, money, and buy a new car. Okay, good. Next, this computer is too slow. What I'm going to do is buy a new computer. Okay. They are not getting good grades in school. Uh -huh. What they going to do to study more? What they uh, going to do? Well, what they need to do is study more. 
que es lo que necesitan hacer. Ok, and finally, I don't need your pity. Ajá. Uh -huh. Why, uh, what I need is your empathy. Okay. Okay, very good. Very good. So this is what we studied on Mon on Friday regarding what clauses. Okay. Very good. Then tonight, we're going to study something different. Okay, tonight's objective is this. At the end of the class, I will be able to tell someone how to do something by using imperatives. Tell someone how to do something by using imperatives. Um, okay. We have a couple of questions here to, to start our discussing. The first question says, what is the first thing you pay attention to when buying a product? What is the first thing you pay attention to when buying a product? And second, what is the most important thing for you? Yeah, of course, when buying a product. What is the most important thing for you? Quality. Okay. But I I will send you to working groups to discuss these questions for five minutes, okay? okay. And then we are going to come back to listen to your opinions. Good evening, teacher. Hey, good evening, Arnold. Okay, we are... Mm -hmm. Five groups at the moment. Okay, discuss the questions, please.
Okay, welcome back. So tell me, what is the first thing you pay attention to when buying a product? The first thing you pay attention to, what is? Okay. Quality. Quality. And relationship between quality and price. Price. Okay, quality versus price. Okay. Uh huh. But how do you how do you know that a product is good quality? Quality is relative. <laughs> quality but, is relative, says Galileo. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay. But you, you, you but you can compare uh, this product with another product. Uh huh. And so. For, for 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 different brands. Okay, what determines good quality in a product? The price. The price? Is uh, I insist. <laughs> I sell the quality is relative because maybe I like some products and other people don't like the same product I like. Uh -huh. yeah. So the quality is relative. But uh, we are compare the quality like synonymous. I'm sorry, how can how I can say synonymous? Yeah, synonymous. Synonymous. Mm -hmm. The quality is a synonymous like the best product uh -huh. uh, but uh, maybe it's a product with a low quality but I like the product so to me it's quality okay uh, it's relative. It's relative. and and yeah because quality is to uh, how can I say to general? How do I how how do you define that this product is good quality for you? Yeah, the design of Mark, the product. For material, the design, for, for, for uh, mark, black mark, the, origin, the brand. Is the, the, material, La, the brand, the material, I, the material duration, duration. Yes. Wow, but if it's new, how do you know that it's going to last? Como sabe que te va a durar? Some products and uh, say um, is made for dur, dur, uh, durar x tiempo, no? Okay. Uh, Saira said design. Design. Yeah, design. Uh -huh. Arnold. In our group, uh, we share the, the first thing is we, we pay attention when uh, buy a product uh, is the caducity. It's so, so important. It, when okay. when we when we buy food, ah okay yes, <laughs> the expiration date. Yeah. Uh huh. When we talk about Cad food, caducity is okay or expense. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, to be honest, I the first thing I pay attention to is the brand. The, the first thing I pay attention is the brand, okay? Because for me, brands, they have their names and their position because of quality. Maybe you can find a different product with the same quality, but different brand, no? Especially with, with uh, appliances, with uh appliances i mean 
refrigerators, uh, washing machines, radios, cell phones. For me, the brand is, is for me, no, the brand is very important. No? Teacher. La marca. Teacher. Uh -huh. and, and try with new brands. Uh, I can try, but if I if I have noticed that the brand is is popular, you know, you know now with the internet, so you can find a lot of review and uh, read. I have an example mm -hmm. uh, when Xiaomi uh, ah. started in the in the market. Many people uh, don't don't like yeah. uh, the Xiaomi, but Xiaomi is a, a, a excellent uh, brand. Yes. For me, the, new, the, new, the, the new. best, the best, the the don't is the top, but uh, está in the sí, in the chart, sí. in the chart of the best uh, brands in this moment. Okay, yes, but at the beginning, I just heard Sayomi. Oh, it's like a, a pajarito at the beginning, or, or, Huawei, yeah. or, or Huawei in, in the way in the beginning, also. The beginning. Huawei, yeah, I said, Oh, Chinese, no or bad say quality, Nokia, 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 and Motorola. <laughs> yeah, okay, talking about cell phones. So quality for me the brand. Um, well, what else? You only have mentioned quality, but quality is, is relative, as Galileo said. What else? What other thing is the I I said brand standard of production or production standard. Oh, okay, production standards. Uh huh. The entity. Uh, that is supervising this production, like oh. like uh, Ministry of Salud, uh -huh. okay. FDA, for example, etc. Uh -huh. Okay, is is if it is certified? Yeah, exactly. The certifications. Yeah, uh -huh. that's a good one. Okay, if the product is certified. Ah, that's important. Okay, good. What else? If you are going to buy a car, for example, if you were going to buy a car, the brand Toyota, the brand. The brand. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, interesting. And the second question says, "What is the most important thing for you?" <laughs> the price the price <laughs> because um, I like the quality but if I don't have money <laughs> yes it's correct <laughs> yes when uh, for example when I go to the supermarket whatever supermarket uh -huh. uh, I like to be comfortable uh -huh. in the, uh, okay in the supermarket Ah, okay. That is really important. Comfort. Uh -huh. Yeah. Comfort. That's what I don't like, Maxi Despensa. <laughs> okay. It's really hot. Uh -huh. <laughs> they, um, they have uh, a big uh, ventiladores. Yes, big fans. Big fan. Yeah, but it's not the same like <laughs> air condition yeah okay so uh, because yeah I, I would like to have an, an uh, a Mac for example as a com in a computer no a Mac but how much is a Mac one thousand five hundred dollars or two thousand dollars so look that teacher no, no, I would like to. <laughs> I would like to. <laughs> yeah, but it's expensive, no? So, okay. 
Well, and the rest, come on, speak people, say something. Digan algo, no se queden ahí calladitos. Something. Yeah. <laughs> okay, now let's practice the conversation. We have a conversation here. Oh, let me share. Okay. A conversation between Ms. Nunez and Mr. Roland. Okay. So listen, I'm going to read the first time. Okay. Pay attention to the pronunciation. Uh, says, hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plant. My name is Miss Nunez, and I'm going to explain what you must do in the production line. Nice to meet you, Miss Nunez. Where do we start? First, you are in charge of stopping the conveyor belt. Please push this red button. Second, grab a pair of tongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. Make sure each meets the specifications in this chart. Third, place the defective chocolate in this funnel. Finally, fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective pieces. Okay, very good. Now, listen and repeat. We're going to read in portions to make it easier. Okay. Uh, let me get the, uh, this. Okay. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plant. Repeat. Hello, Mr. Hello, Mr. Mr. Roland. My name is Ms. Nunez and I'm going to explain what you must do in the production line. My name is Ms. Nunez and I am going to explain what you must do in the production line. Nice to meet you, Ms. Nunez. Where do we start? Nice, nice to meet you, Ms. Nunez. Where do we start? First, you are in charge of stopping the conveyor plan, uh, belt. First, you are in charge of stopping the conveyor belt. Please push this red button. Please push the red button. Second, grab a pair of tongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Read this chart and check every piece. Make sure each meets the specifications in this chart. Make sure each meets the specifications in this chart. Third, place the defective chocolate in this funnel. Finally, finally, fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective pieces. Finally, fill in a report at the end of the day about the defective pieces. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, who, um, let me see. Who is working 
by the first time in the company? Whose who's first day in the company is? Mrs. Ah, who's working for the first day? Mr. Ronald. Mr. Roland, okay. Mr. Roland is on his first day at the plant. Okay. Uh, what is Mr. Roland in charge of? Of stopping the convert your belt. Okay, he's in charge of stopping the conveyor belt. Okay. Um, what is the product he's working with? Chocolate. 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 Okay, chocolate. What is the last activity Mr. Roland must do? What is the report? Uh -huh. How about the pieces? Uh, okay. Yeah, fill in a report about the defective pieces. Okay, very good, very good. Now, um, some vocabulary here, let me check. Hello, Mr. Roland, today is your first day at the plan. My name is Ms. Nunez, I am going to explain what you must do. Uh, the conveyor belt, what is the conveyor belt? La cinta transportadora. Exactly, okay, la cinta transportadora, ¿no? Esa que lleva el producto en una, ma en una máquina, en una fábrica, ¿no? The conveyor belt. Um, what is grab? What is grab? Grab. Grabar, o sea, ya, no. 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 Sorry. Don't be sorry. Look for it in the dictionary. Tomar. Tomar drink, like drink. Agarrar. A agarrar. Sí, tomar, pero no de beber, ¿verdad? Sino de sí. agarrar. Ok. So, grab a pair of tongs. What is tongs? Pinzas o... Oh. Ajá. Pinzas, ¿verdad? No. Ok. Grab a pair of tongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Uh, read this, uh, please. It meets the specifications in this chart. What is the meaning of meat here? Make sure each meets the specifications in this chart. Comando, mandamiento? No. Satisfacer. Satisfacer, cumplir, en este caso, ¿no? Las especificaciones. En esa lista, ok. Uh -huh. uh, place the defective chocolate in this funnel. What is funnel? It's like a embudo. Exactly. Un embudo. ¿verdad? So can you imagine the situation? Can you imagine Mr. Roland's job? Yes. Okay, so he stops the conveyor belt. How how can she, can he stop or what 
does he have to do to stop the conveyor belt? The uh, conveyor belt stop when he pushed the red button. Ah, okay. So to stop the conveyor belt, he must push the red button. Okay, in the machine, a red button, push the red button and the conveyor belt stops. Next, grab a pair of tongs and pick every piece of chocolate. Okay, then he check the product with the, with the chart. And if the product meets the specifications, okay, perfect. The defective chocolate, the defective product, he puts it into a funnel. And finally, fill in a report. Okay, that is Mr. Roland's work. Mr. Roland's job. Okay. Any question? No, okay. So uh, there are three questions here about the conversation. We already talked about this. Uh, first says, who is responsible for stopping the conveyor belt? Two, what are some of Mr. Roland's responsibilities? And three, what kind of machinery is there in your workplace? Okay, so I'm going to send you in groups. I want you to practice the conversation. Okay, please practice the conversation uh, in pairs and respond these questions. Okay. Let's see. Okay, groups again, pairs. Okay, work in pairs, practice the conversation two, three, four times and respond the questions. Teacher. See you in 10 minutes. Teacher. Tell me. Teacher. Yes. ¿Cómo se dice tecle? Tecle. Que es la... <laughs> para, levant, para levantar eh, cosas pesadas es como... Tiraje de cadena. Ok. Porque ahora uh, busqué y no me sale. Yes, because no creo que aparezca como tecle. Bueno, habría que buscar el término correcto de tecle. Ok, gracias. Anda, lo busco y te, te digo. Ok, eh, entonces ahí están las parejas. Por favor, practice the conversation and respond the questions. Oh,
Hello, people. You must be practicing and working together. Yeah. Yes, it's true. Please practice yes, the conversation, yes. okay? Yes, teacher. Um, yes, the... Dinora. No, 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 teacher. Okay. Uh, Dinora, by the way, tonight session one on one is with you, okay? Okay, teacher. Right. See you later. See you later, session. Ajá. También está, está esa, están las pinzas, que no sé si es mm -hmm. el graph. Mm -hmm. eh, yeah. um, no sé, quiero ver qué más. Pa, 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 right here. Um, eh, está... Yeah. Okay, um, and the finish, the last question is, uh, uh, what kind of match? Puede ver mi pantalla? Can you see my screen? Sí, sí se puede. Okay. Okay. Go ahead. Hello, Mr. Roland. Today is your first day at the plane. My name is Miss Nunez. Um, I am going to explain what the what the most doing the product line. Production line. Nice to meet you, Miss Nunez. Grab a pair of the song. Ajá, que ese es el proceso. Every price of chocolate. Ajá. De tener el, ajá. Read this chart. Check every price. Chart, chart. Y en la última sería. Check. Computer. Computer. And I am use a computer and printer. Ok. Fine. Ahí está, entonces practicamos de nuevo. Cabal. Ah, pues empieza usted, Anali. <ríe> Le quiero dar la oportunidad. <ríe> El diálogo largo. <ríe> Hello, Mr. Ronald. Today is your first day at the plane. My name is Computer. OPC. POS. Okay. Computer, no, está bien. Sí, computer. The computer, printer, me dijo. Printer. printer. POS. Post. No. 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 Effective. Eh, no. In the system. Ah. Electronic. Mm -hmm. Voucher Manu. Hola. Ahí sería, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Es que no me cabe en el libro. ¿Ah? Ah, no para transcribirlo. Uh -huh. Pero póngale en la celda.
Okay, welcome back. Now we have three questions here quickly. Who is responsible for stopping the conveyor belt? Mr. Roland. Mr. Roland. What are some of Mr. Roland's responsibilities? Give me one, only one. First, one by one. The red button. Sorry? Push the red button. Aha. Stop the conveyor belt. Stopping Stop the, the conveyor, conveyor belt. belt. Okay. Another Is every piece of chocolate. Uh-huh. <clears throat> Gray a pair of some. In general. Mm -hmm. In general, um quality uh, of, of chocolate. Ajá, que, pero ¿cuál es la responsabilidad de él? Check every pie, pie. Check. Okay. Every piece. Every piece. Okay, check chocolate's quality. Mm -hmm. Okay. And what um, else? And um, um, made a report at the end of the day about the defective Okay. Yes. Fill in a report about the defective pieces. Pieces, pieces. Yes, pieces. pieces. And this, what kind of machinery is there in your workplace? Okay, I think everyone can participate in this. What kind of machinery is there in your workplace? Aha. Uh -huh. Dinora? The conveyor belt. In your company? In your workplace? Uh, no, in my workplace. Um, uh, make line. Make line. Mm -hmm. what, mesa is the, de what is the make line? La mesa de producción. Ah, okay. Jonathan? What is the machinery in your workplace? Um, I don't, there are, there are not machines in, in my workplace because I work at the home. You work at home? Yes. Nice. Okay. Catherine? Is there any machinery in your workplace? I know how a machine exactly, maybe caja registradora because it's a bank. And ah, okay. Cajeros automáticos. How do you say cajeros automáticos, teacher? Actually, it's ATM. Yeah. Yeah. ATM. It's for automatic trading machine. Automatic trading machine. Mm -hmm. ATMs. Mm -hmm. ah, okay. Okay, Galileo. Okay, in my work, there are at least four machines. Uh huh. Uh, the first machine name is mixer. Okay. Uh, this is the machine where we mix the ingredients to okay. make the dough pizza. Uh -huh. The second machine is one divider. Oh. The divider puts uh, some dough according to the weight uh -huh. to each, each dough. It's uh, it don't have a specific, a specific weight. Okay. And the divider puts every spice. And the first machine is the conical rounder. 
the conical rounder make uh, a form, uh, make the form of the ball. And uh, finally, there are a machine uh, rounder, just only rounder. Uh, the rounder make uh, el acabado de la bola. The finishing. F finish. Finishing. Of finishing of the ball of dough piece. Oh, okay. Okay. Interesting. Yeah. Good. Rodrigo, is there any machinery in your workplace? Hmm? No, the product finally. Just final products. So you don't no, have machinery. Oh, oh, um, uh, forklift? Yes. Okay. In, in, in tractor. no. tractors. Tractors. Yes, no, montacarga. Ah, forklift. 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 Okay, yes. good. Brian, is there any machinery in your workplace? Computer. Uh, printer. Okay. Okay. Mary, Mary. Is there any machinery in your workplace? Uh, sí. Las, las bajas donde se pasa el producto, que no sé cómo se llama exactamente. Eh, donde se pasan los tintes, donde se hacen los tintes. Se van moviendo. Sí, sí, ajá. Es un conveyor belt. Pues esas, montacargas, computadoras. Hey. Good English. Sorry, teacher. Se me fue. Fork, fork lift. Los montacargas son es. Fork es tenedor y como se les llama forklift porque tienen esa forma de, de tenedor, ¿verdad? Y levantan, lift, sí. levantar, elevar. Por eso se llaman forklift. Yeah. Ok, good. Uh, Arnold. Spanish. <laughs> I, I sent yeah. in WhatsApp the picture in, of, for the tecle. And the word in English for tecle. Uh, I don't know. I sent it to you. Thanks. The winch. Winch. Yeah. Uh, winch. We have we have winch, two winches. Okay. Um computer. POS. Uh -huh. um, two multifunctions. Multifunctions. Yeah. Ah, printer, photocopier. Two, two trucks. Trucks, okay. Okay. Um, and a four leaf. Okay. Good. No more. Very good. Laura, machinery in your workplace? In my workplace, no machine. No machine. Uh, no, I am use a computer and printer. Okay, good. Pierre, machinery in your workplace? Um, I know machine in my work, but um, I think, okay, I think um, servers, uh, printers, computers. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. Anna Lilian, is there any machinery in your workplace? My work usually my computer and printer. Okay. Zyra? Machineries? Yes, teacher. Computer, ATM, printer, washer. Um, industrial. Ah, okay. Okay, yeah. very good. 
Very good. Uh, oops, it's time for the second attendance, actually too late. I forgot. Okay, quickly please, Ana Lilian Reyes. Present. Thank you, Brian Javier Carmona. Hello. Present. Dinor Alejandro Alfaro. Present teacher. Uh, Frida Janine Mejia. No. Javier Aldair Escobar. Present teacher. Good. Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. Jose Arnoldo Mazariego. No, he's talking and talking and not paying attention. Jose Galileo Barrera. Present teacher. Eh, Jose Jonathan Vigil. Present. Eh, Jose Rodrigo Hernández. Present. Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Present teacher. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present teacher. María Concepción Cerón. Present teacher. María Ivania Palma. Present teacher. Ok. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Mayra Veralice Moreno. Rocío Raúl Regina Mitel. Zaira Marlene Larín. Present teacher. Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present teacher. A ver, José Arnoldo Mazariego. Se durmió. Yeah, I saw that. Talking and talking, everyone. And... Es que estábamos hablando con mi esposa por allá. <laughs> ok. No lo vuelvo a hacer, mi amor. <laughs> que no sabes, pobrecito yo. Ok, very good. Uh, now. Let's take a look to the grammar topic, which is imperative for today. Hablando de órdenes. Let's see the Éxito. imperative. Exitazo total. Uh, talking about commands. Sí, mi amor. Uh, yes. <laughs> Bueno, ahí les dejé la foto del tecle. ¿Verdad? Que ahora sé que se llama tecle. Y que en in inglés es winch. Ok. Les dejo también la grabación del, de la conversación. ¿Les sirve eso o no les sirve eso? Yes, yes, teacher. Sí, yes, teacher. Yes. yes, thank you. Practice, practice. Okay, imperatives. Use imperatives to give an order. Yeah. To give an order, to give instructions, or to make invitations. Imperatives do not have a subject. Yeah, examples. Read this chart and check every piece. Okay, no dice you, no dice he, no dice I. So imperatives, sentences don't have subject. So instructions, orders, or even invitations. Unplug this cord and connect the blue one. Fill in a report about the defective pieces. Verify the oil, the oil level. Okay, let's practice these sentences. Repeat after me, please. Read this chart and check every piece. Read this chart and check every piece. Okay. Fill in a report about the defective pieces. Fill in a report about the defective pieces. Unplug this cord 
and connect the blue one. Verify the oil level. Okay, very good. Just let me show you um, some other, a little bit more information about the imperative. <laughs> Hey, cuenta hola, el chiste. Hola, hola, Cuen hola, chiste. Cuenta el chiste. Tell the joke. Okay. Uses of imperatives. I'm going to share this in WhatsApp later. Okay. Como ya dijimos, give orders. Examples. Come here at once. Take that gum out of your mouth. <laughs> orders give instructions take one pill every 12 hours open your books on page 33 give warnings what is warning people when, when the other people must take care Ah, ok. So, precaución, advertencias, warnings. Ok, give warnings. Don't sit on the bench. It's wet paint. Don't smoke. It's bad for your health. Warnings. Make an invitation. Have some tea. It's still hot. Come in and sit down. We are having tea. Ah, this is British. We are having coffee. Okay. Ah, on signs. Signs. What is sign? What? Symbols. Ajá. Señales. Señales, rótulos, ¿verdad? Signs. Push. Pull. Give way. Stay on your right. So we use imperatives. And give advice. Go home and get some help. You look exhausted. Tell me about your trip to Ireland. Okay. So, uses of imperatives. Let's practice these sentences, please. Repeat after me. Come here at once. Come here at Come once. Here Come here at, at once. once. Take that gum out of your mouth. Get that gun out of your mouth. Take one pill every 12 hours. Take one, one pill every 12 hours. Open your books on page 33. Open your books on page 33. Push. 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 Pull. Pull. Give way. Give Give way. way. Stay on your right. Stay on your right. 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 Don't sit on the bench. It's wet paint. Don't sit on the bench. It's wet paint. It's wet paint. It. Don't smoke. It's bad for your health. Have some tea. It's still hot. Come in and sit down. We're having tea. We are having tea. 
Go home and get some sleep. You look exhausted. Go home and get some sleep. Go home and get some sleep. You look exhausted. Tell me about your trip to Ireland. Ireland. Okay, very good. Thank you, teacher. We are look exhausted. You look exhausted. <laughs> <laughs> no, you are young. You are young. Okay, any question with this? No questions? No questions. Good. So uh, let me share this in WhatsApp for, with you. So you can have it. Teacher. Yes. Una pregunta. ¿A quién le tocan los, los diez minutos el miércoles? ¿Qué le salía a mí? El miércoles. Ya. Ya te digo. Miércoles no. Eh, te toca el jueves. Ah, el jueves. Ok, no hay problema. Mm -hmm. Ok. okay. Tonight is with Dinora, tomorrow with Frida, Wednesday with Javier, Thursday Arnoldo, and Friday Galileo. Okay. okay. Then let me give you, let me share this one. And finally, this one. Okay, I already shared three pictures in WhatsApp and let me tell you what is, what are they for? Okay. Ya que dijimos que eh, el imperative is used for signs. Vamos a practicar un poquito de signs and symbols. Okay. Let's study a little bit about this. In symbols, ustedes lo deben de saber mejor que yo, sobre todo los que están en in areas industriales. If the symbol is red, that means prohibition. Okay. Red symbol means prohibition. So means the meaning is you must not or do not do or stop. Okay. Red means stop. In this, this circle, that's the forma. No admittance, no smoking, no dirty clothes. Okay. Blue is some, that something is mandatory. Mandatory. So an obligation. You must do carry out the action given by the sign. Tienes que cumplir o hacer lo que se te pide en el símbolo. Blue means obey. Azul significa obedece. Keep clear. Head protection must be worn. Wear gloves. Yellow means warning. Okay, warning, caution, risk of danger, hazard ahead, hazard, peligro, riesgo. 
Yellow means risk of danger. Danger, high voltage. Danger, mind your head. Danger, forklift in operations. And green means the safe way. Where to go in an emergency. The safe condition, seguridad, algo. Eso significa el green. Green means go. First aid station, emergency phone, emergency exit. Some information about signs. I multipurpose signs. No, que tienen varios instrucciones. Supplementary text. Símbolos con un poco de texto. Fire equipment signs. Todo para cuestiones de incendios. And mm, work traffic signs. ¿Verdad? Símbolos de tráfico en el trabajo. Turn left or don't turn left. Uh, no, go this way. I don't know. Stop, etc. No. This is some information about signs. Okay. And signs express imperatives. We use imperatives to describe signs. No. Usamos imperativos para describir la, varios símbolos. Ok, entonces, tomando esto en cuenta, I want you to, no, sigo aquí, sigo acá. Vean todos estos símbolos que están acá, ahí se los compartía también. 61 symbols, 61 signs. ¿Ya? Uh, I want you to I, I'm going to split you in groups Ooh, we have 20 minutes and I will give you the numbers voy a dar números del uno al tanto grupo uno de tal número a tal número grupo grupo dos y así sucesivamente a ver cuántos podemos cubrir. Y solamente que nos pongan qué, qué significa ese símbolo. Ok, using imperatives. Ok. Bien. Eso vamos a hacer ahorita. Ok, vamos a dividirlos en grupos. Okay. My group number one would be uh, Javier, Galileo, and Laura. Okay. Quiero que me. I want you to work on numbers. There are how many groups? Five groups. Yeah. One to ten. Okay, group number one, one to ten. Group number two, eleven to twenty. Que serían Dinora, Ivania, and Zaira. Eleven to twenty. Group number three, uh, twenty-one to thirty. Sería Ana Lilian, 
María Concepción y José Rodrigo. Group number three, from 21 to 30. Group number four, tenemos Jonathan y Catherine. Del 31 to 40. Y group number five, Brian y Wendy. Del 41 al 50. Ya. Si no saben qué significa, inventen. Usando un imperative. ¿Verdad? Inventen. Usando un imperative. Ok. Vean el símbolo. Recuerden los símbolos. Expresan instrucciones en imperative. Y eso es lo que quiero que hagan. ¿Está claro? Any question with the activity? Eh, no le escuché, teacher, eh, de qué número a qué número nos toca. Este es el grupo. Nora, Ivania y Zaira. Del 11 al 20. Ok. Eh, Mi teacher. Oh, come on. Al 10. Ok, Brian, 41 to 50. No, Jonathan. Jonathan, 31 to 40. <laughs> okay. Any question? No, sir. Okay. Go.
teacher. Hello, Ivania. Este, tuve problemas con el Inter y me, sal, me, me salí del grupo. ¿Con quién estaba? Estoy en el grupo 2 con Saraí. Ok. Ahí va.
teacher. Hello. Hello, sin querer queriendo me salí de mi sesión. Oh, bueno, pero la verdad que ya los llamé de regreso. Ay, bueno, sorry. Ok, no problem. Solta la almohada. <risa> Lo vieron. Sí, va, sí, va. Sí. Ok. Ok, people, I know it's not enough time, but it's time to finish tonight. Ahí revisamos mañana a ver cómo, cómo les fue. Ok, Ana Lilian Reyes. Ana Lilian Reyes, se le cayó el Inter. ¿Qué pasó? Se le congeló la imagen ahí. Estaba oh. con nosotros, el grupo. Ah. Brian Javier Carmona. Brian Javier. Present. Ok. Dinor Alejandra Alfaro. Present teacher. Thank you. Frida Janine. Javier Aldair Escobar. Present teacher. Ok. Good morning. <laughs> José Arnoldo Mazariego. He's gone. José Galileo Barrera. Present teacher. Good. José Jonathan Vigil. Present. Thank you. José Rodrigo Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you. Catherine Marcela Castaneda. Present teacher. Thank you. Laura Carolina Vigil. Present teacher. Thank you. María Concepción Cerón. Present teacher. Thank you. María Ivania Palma. María Ivania Palma. Mauricio Antonio Orellana. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Mayra Veralice Moreno, Rocío Lourdes Pimentel, Zaira Marlene Larín. Present teacher. And Wendy Maribel Zabaleta. Present teacher. Okay, people, that's all for today. See you tomorrow. Have a good night. Take care. Good night. Good night, teacher. Bye-bye. Good night, teacher. Bye -bye. Good, night, good, night, teacher. Bye. good night. Sweet dreams. <laughs>
I felt bad since Friday. No. Since Friday. And so I I was sleeping all weekend, Saturday and Sunday, with a lot of medicine. Panadol multisymptoms. Multisymptoms. Symptoms. Symptoms. Mm -hmm. So my weekend, so I was relaxed, but today I wake up with a good feelings. Yeah, but it, it was just the flu. Yeah. Ah, okay. Today I feel better. Okay. Did you go to work or do you have a uh, license? No, I... I went to the work ah, okay. at the a.m. <laughs> and and did you did you have the vaccine already, or you don't believe in the vaccine, the COVID vaccine? Yeah. Yes, I have the vaccine, two doses. Okay. Did you? Yeah, but the the flu is. Is the same. <laughs> yeah. Did you feel any symptoms with the vaccine? Or yes. Nothing? Really? I have fever. You had fever? Yeah. Oh. With the first one or the second one? With both. Both? I have fever. And my arm. It hurt me a lot. Oh, and and which which vaccine did you get? La Moderna. La Moderna. I heard that that is, um, I don't know, stronger or tougher or more. Because <laughs> I had the Sinovac, and I didn't feel anything. My yeah. mother, my mother also had the Sinovac and she didn't have any symptoms. My wife, but one of my daughters had the Moderna. Yeah, and she, and she hurt their arm and had some bones ache. Uh, it's just... It give, that gives more symptoms. Yeah. I prefer the Sinovac. <laughs> but they say that if you get one in the first dose, you cannot get a different one in the second dose. Yes. You have to get the same. Yes. It's better than mm -hmm. My two doses was uh, Moderna. And when did you get the, the second one? The in Mega Centro. So, uh -huh. so the hospital. But when? Uh, when um, on vacation. August vacation. Oh, like really? Three or four. I don't know. Oh. And did, did you have um, holidays or so free days in, in holidays? Yeah, I was on holiday. So I was fever all holiday. <laughs> And do you have a, a, in your company you have the whole week or just few days? Few days. I was to work. I was working on Monday. Only Monday, uh, Thursday, Wednesday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday, and Friday. It was three days. Ah, good, good. Yeah. And, and tell me, what is the best of your work? What is the 
what do you like the most in your in your work? I like the most that we can eat a lot of pizza <laughs> wherever we want. Hey, you need to invite me some date. <laughs> yeah. You need to give me some some coupons or something. No, Papa John doesn't have coupons, right? <laughs> yeah, they have coupons. No, oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Send me, I will send give me you. <laughs> I will give you some coupons. Good. I like Papa John's. We have here in Lourdes. We have Papa yeah. John's. And I like uh, the restaurant. It's nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's so nice. Uh, okay, but if you, if you had to tell me some of your activities at work, what are some of your responsibilities at work? Uh, I have to do the purchase. I am, I'm working as import manager at Papa John. So I have to purchase all the ingredients from USA. Mm -hmm. So I have to, I have to request and but buy. You, bu you you buy from the same company yeah different keys different uh -huh. keys from usa uh -huh. so i have to import uh, the raw material the uh, ingredients and i have to do all the coordination no uh -huh. Okay. With the freight forward and all the negotiation with them and the price. Yeah, I, we, when I have to do the, yeah, the permission with the minsal. Oh, and, and who, who is the owner of the franchise here in El Salvador? Uh, the last name, uh, Novoa. Novoa. Oh, okay. Yeah. And are there other, other franchises under that company? No. Only Papa John's. Only Papa John's, yeah. Ah, okay, okay. And what is your favorite product in Papa John's? Um, the unos nuditos de ajo, garlic nuts. Ah, ah. <laughs> that, that is my favorite. Really? So I thought one pizza. <laughs> ah. yeah, yeah, it's better pizza, but it's the better pizza, but I like. I prefer the garlic nuts. Yeah, are good. Are good. So the how do you call it? Because it's it's the the garlic margarine is, is delicious. Yeah. yeah, it's delicious. The peppers, oh, the peppers are are good. I'm I'm getting hungry. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, and, and how many people do you work with? How many people are in your department? We are like 20. 20? So you 20. are in charge of 20 people? No, my boss is in charge of them. And I, another of the team. Ah, okay. Okay. Una, una más del equipo. <laughs> no, nah, but they are in charge of the import, so that is a lot of responsibility. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because if something if something is not ready, so it's your fault. Yeah. <laughs> Imagine. <sighs> and and 
it's it's terrible because I remember I don't know well well it's not maybe not responsible for of the of the manager the general manager of the imports but the the manager in the restaurant in I remember I went, well, a long time ago in a pollo campero they ran out of pollo campero they ran out of chicken we went for chicken and they said I'm sorry we don't have chicken <laughs> imagine yeah. that's crazy uh, if you go to a pizza and they say no I'm sorry we don't have pizza we don't have ingredients we don't have mm. they killing me <laughs> <laughs> Yes, yeah. So it's your responsibility now. I say, if there is something missing in Papa John's, it's the Nora's fault. It's my fault. <laughs> Every time they tell me, oh, I'm sorry, we don't have that today. Mm, the Nora. <laughs> uh. <laughs> and then I will go to cry. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, Dinora, it's time. So have a nice rest. Okay. Okay, teacher. Thank and have you. Have a good night. Bye bye. Bye. Take care.